Hi, I'm Henry, and yep, I'm finally doing it. After almost 19 years of not being a college student, I'm about to do the unthinkable. You just caught me getting a head start on my packing. You know, it's always good to start packing a bit early so that you don't have to worry about it later. It's June 1st. It's been a long, hard road to get here, but I feel like I'm ready. It's gonna be my first time living away from home, but I've learned to do all the adult stuff like laundry and taxes and shit. I've been working on developing good work habits that help me actually be productive instead of spending three hours every morning road scrolling. I've been working on getting medicated for my ADHD that caused me to drop out of high school, and also just been trying to become a more outgoing person so I can hopefully have more than one real life friend. Oh, and speaking of Jack, he's coming over today. We're gonna do a thing! So there's this show we both like called The Amazing World of Gumball. Uh, actually a big part of how we became friends. Uh, but in one episode of the show, uh, the two main characters, uh, Gumball and Darwin, had this big, overly complicated, overly long, 40 second long secret handshake that they did with each other. Uh, and a while ago, Jack said, hey, we should recreate that, that'd be fun. And I said, okay, because it would be fun, I think. Um, one problem with that is that there is this one part of it where they kiss each other on the hands, which is a little bit uncomfortable. So we're doing it in Pride Month, because everyone's gay in Pride Month. It's an inside joke on top of another inside joke. That's just what happens when you're friends for almost seven years. Man, almost seven years. That's almost seven years. Man, I'm gonna miss having him around when I'm in college. Well, I better not dwell on that. It's summer before college, and it's gonna be the best summer ever, because we have plans. Several plans. Here he is now. Hey, Jack, you ready to do the thing? No! Okay, now ready. Okay, cool. So, slap, slap, fist bump. <laughs> Go from like facing forward and then turn around. Uh, first part is like by far the easiest. I think it's the. Yeah. Uh, we're halfway there, technically. Wait, no, we're not halfway there. I still can't tell what this is. <laughs> Let's see, it's not. Shut off! Fist bump. Elbow, elbow. Double low, double low, double five, double handshake. High, low, low, fist, elbow, noses, butt. Together, F, box. Box 8:58 p.m. It doesn't need to be good. It just needs to be there. The brain is not designed to handle this much yeah, information. No, no. Yeah! Oh fuck! Fucking do this. Hey dude. 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 Hey We did it! Jack! Jack, we fucking did it! We finally did it! What time is it? What time is it? Okay, let's it's check. Let's check. 943. 9.43. We started at like... 7.20. 7.20, okay. It took 2 hours and 20 minutes. We fucking okay, did it. Friendship. 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 Look, post the camera. Ow! Friendship! <laughs> It's time for a summer montage song The time we have together isn't very long We're gonna make the most of it before it's gone So you better get ready for a summer montage song We started off the summer with a big celebration With Henry showing up at Jack's high school graduation 
Henry was a dropout so he didn't have one But they had a party anyway and that was kind of fun At 11pm we got burgers and fries sat in a parking lot and we talked about our lives Jack heard dad a safe way and did not think it was cool While Henry taught kids how to swim at the pool that's right, it's a summer montage song Two friends having fun all summer long If you know the words, then you can sing along But you don't, just strap in for a summer montage song We played Sonic 06 cause we thought it would be funny When we started it way back in early 2020 But we weren't big fans of what the game had in store So we went upstairs and played Just Dance 4 we hung out together and debated ethicality But then it was time to turn our dreams into reality We strapped our seatbelts on our chests and our hip And we went on an awesome end of summer road trip If you think there's anything more to this than you are wrong This is a healthy male friendship where we care about each other Unironically And if you ship us together we will come to your house And snap your neck platonically So I hope you were ready for a summer montage song Oh hi Jack Hi is uh Henry there? Uh, I just wanted to hang out with him because, like, you know, it's the last day of summer, kind of want to end it on a high note, all that. Oh, sorry, Henry's not here. He went for a walk and hasn't come back yet. Oh, for fuck's sake, again? You can come in and wait for him if you want. No, no, I know where to find him. Oh, hi, Jack. What are you doing here? Oh, you know, just hanging out under my usual tree. Mm-hmm. It's a good tree. Sturdy, reliable. This guy's not going anywhere. It's good to have a tree like this in your life. I see. But I'm not going to be with the tree forever. Soon, I'm going to move away, and I mean, the tree won't be in the same city anymore. Yeah, I know there are other trees, but I like this tree. It's a good tree. It's always been my go-to tree, you know? I mean, I don't even know if I'll be able to find other trees. My tree finding skills aren't very good, and it was kind of a miracle I was able to find this one. It's a metaphor? It's a metaphor. Jack, you've been a great friend to me for a third of my life now. You've always been there for me when I needed you. My life's gonna be a lot harder without you. We're still gonna be friends. That's not gonna change. You know, we'll still call and text and play Minecraft together. You know, the main three forms of communication. Yeah, I know, but I mean, going places, doing things, you pointing a camera at me when I need you to. Dude, we both care too much about this friendship to let it die. You know that. Yeah, I know. I love you, man. I love you too. Platonically. Platonically. I'm gonna miss Portland too. I'm not. That's just because you live next to all the drug addicts. I don't live next to there. I mean, yeah, but you live way up in the hills, so you have to go through there to get anywhere. That's fair. Meanwhile, I live in this great neighborhood with parks everywhere and metaphorical resident trees and salt and straws right there. Dude, you'll be okay. Yeah, I know. I'm just gonna miss this place. You want me to worry where? Not particularly. Too bad. Friendship! Well, this is it. It's move-in day. Tomorrow, I'll be waking up in a new bed, in a new city, in a new part of my life. What am I doing? Oh, I'm just killing time in the upstairs bathroom. It's the one part of this house hasn't been in the video yet. It's actually Jack's move-in day, too. We're gonna call tonight and see how things are going with one of the most eventful days of our lives. <sighs> Alright. Should be time to go in about... Now.
I can't believe I'm moving to a city without a flag. Alright, so here I am at college. I just arrived. I'll be meeting my new roommate and just now. Hopefully they are someone cool, someone I can get along with, someone who doesn't suck. Let's see. Oh, hey, Jack. 